Matapang na ibinahagi ni Michelle Madrigal na naging biktima siya ng sexual abuse sa murang edad. Hindi niya idinetalye kung sino at kung ano ang eksaktong edad niya nang nangyari iyon, pero ilang taon daw niya iyong dinanas noon. Those close to me understand that I'm a survivor myself. To be completely transparent, I endured sexual abuse at a tender age for a number of years, a time when my innocence was truly taken, leading to a tumultuous adolescence. Hindi raw lubusang naintindihan ni Michelle ang epekto ng pang-aabusong dinanas niya noon. Kaya raw naging outlet niya ang bisyo. Lahat ni Michelle, unaware that I was experiencing PTSD, post-traumatic stress disorder, I carried this burden alone until I sought help from a therapist at dalawampu. For nearly a decade, I held on to something that was finally released when I opened up. Understanding my rebellious face suddenly made sense. Shame and self-blame consumed me for years. I was angry, indifferent, sikang solace in drugs and alcohol to escape the overwhelming emotions, unworthiness, and fear. I often questioned why it happened to me. Ang mapait na karanasan sa murang edad, pati na rin ang mga sugat na dala ng mga dinanas niyang pagsubok sa buhay, ang hinarap ni Michelle. Ibinahagi ni Michelle na malaking tulong sa kanya ang pagiging bahagi ng community na naiintindihan ang kanyang pinagdaanan. But here I am today, praying and seeking guidance from God on how best to serve others. I aim to use my voice and experiences to empower others to step forward and begin their healing journey. This year, in conversations with women, I was astonished to find that tatlong out of five had encountered some form of sexual abuse. My purpose in life is clear, to support survivors. I've always yearned to use my voice for a greater cause, and my mission is to help one survivor at a time feel acknowledged and secure, reassuring them that their story is significant. Si Michelle ay may anim na taong gulang na anak, si Annika, sa ex-husband na si Troy Woolfolk. Read more about Michelle Madrigal, Survivor, Sexual Abuse, Healing. Si Michelle ay may anim na taong gulang na anak, si Annika, sa ex-husband na si Troy Woolfolk. Read, Michelle Madrigal opens up about reasons that led to her heartbreaking divorce. Gusto raw niya na protektahan ang anak sa pamamagitan ng tamang paggabay dito. As a mother, it is my paramount responsibility to educate my daughter about these realities. Past generations often lack the knowledge or tools to address such issues, often sweeping them under the rug in different cultures. Many children don't feel safe to confide to anyone, let alone their parents, about their experiences. I'm determined to change that narrative, to extend a helping hand, and foster an environment where openness and support prevail. Kaugnay nito, hinikayat ni Michelle ang kanyang IG followers na suportahan ng Rain or Rape, Abuse at Incest National Network, na ayon sa website nito ay isang US-based anti-sexual violence organization. Layunin nito na sumaklolo sa mga biktima ng sexual abuse at magbigay ng karampatang tulong sa mga ito, ibinahagi rin ni Michelle ang hotline numbers ng organisasyon. Sa Pilipinas, ang Philippine Commission on Women, PCW, ang nangangasiwa sa Violence Against Women and Their Children Desk na nagbibigay ng counseling at legal advice sa gender-based violence. Ayon sa website ng PCW, narito ang hotline numbers para sa mga sumusunod, National Emergency Hotline, Sham Naraan at Labing Isa. Aling Police Hotline, 0919-777-7377. PNP Women and Children Protection Center. 24-7th AVAWCD Office, 02-8532-6690 Public Attorney's Office, PAO. Hotline, 02-8929-9436 Local 106, 107, or 104, Operator, Interagency Council on Violence Against Women and Their Children. Mobile numbers, 0917867190749454558121.